AI is getting so good at making videos that I'm afraid of getting replaced. And I know that day might come, but I hope it doesn't. Now on this video, I'm going to show you this platform that's called Hilu AI that has a really great capability of creating videos. It's actually on one of the top charts for the artificial image to video leaderboard and Minimax Hilo 2. It's at number two. It's even better than VO3 with no audio. So it's a great platform to make your videos. Now, I think that the relation between price and the credits that you're going to get is a fantastic deal. So definitely check it out. Link in the description. So go ahead and test it out right now. Now, the first thing I want to do is show you the new start to end frame feature that they just launched. Now, this will help you accomplish videos that are going to have the same sequence because you'll be able to control the start and the end. Now, let me show you a few videos that I've created already. So let's get started. Now, let me go ahead and jump into my videos and I'm going to show you a few videos that I've created already. Now, what did I do? Well, I added a start frame and an end frame and I gave it a prompt that, that I wanted to use for that start to end frame. Plus, you can continue this sequence by adding that end frame to the first frame and then continue that video, which is pretty cool. Let me show you the videos that I've generated. So this is me turning into a soldier. Here we go. It's a soldier scene. That's still me. I, it's got my face and we got the soldier scene and the end frame is going to be that one right there where the soldier is running, which you can see right here. That's the end frame. So that was my end frame and this was my first frame and it generated the video with the prompt that I provided, which is pretty cool. Now, all I have to do is add that end frame to the beginning and continue my story with something that I need to talk about or make the story about or a movie, right? Here's another one, which I really like because it turns into a flamethrower guy. So that's me. I turn into a soldier and then I grab this flamethrower and I'm good to go. I mean, that's me in the video. That's pretty cool. So that again, start frame and the end frame. Isn't that cool? So all I did was tell it this is what I want. Give it the prompt and I'm good to go. So a fantastic feature here on Hilu for the start and end frame. So go ahead and get started and use it right now. Now, let me go ahead and show you the rest of the videos that are pretty cool here on Hilu. Now, I've already generated several videos here and I like how realistic they look. I like the quality that it has and I like the amount of details and options that we have to generate these videos. So let me go ahead and start with the first one. So this is a watch that I wanted to create. It's a skeleton timepiece of a Rolex watch. You can see how good this looks. So if a watch company made a super professional video of their watch, you know, it would look like this. I mean, they would take a close shot and it'll look really shiny and nice, just like this one is looking. Here's another one. This is just a test of a cinematic look. This is from an image. All I did was add the image and it generated the rest for me. Now, one of the things that I think that Hilo 2 shines is with the image to video. So it uses this as a reference. This is a prompt. Again, another cinematic look where it it moves and it zooms. Here's another watch timepiece that I've created here. I love how the stainless steel looks on these videos. I mean, it looks so good. All right. Here's another one of that guy. Here's me. Um, here it is. Stop smiling and get scared. So it's just a little image there from the image. It generated this <laughs> crazy, right? Here's the logo to a digital watch. Here we go. Turn that logo into a digital watch. And I've did, I did several of these. Here's a Nutella one turns breakfast into well, turns Nutella into breakfast. Get Nutella spreads it there and we got the rest of the elements there. Let me go ahead and show you this one too. Here is another prompt. Uh, this one I really like. Look at that. I even got some snow effect here. I wish I had that hair now, but I don't. <laughs> uh, here's another one with the dog zoom out and a pedestal down tilt up. So that's like a cinematic look. Here's me fixing a bike. Here's me in a museum. I'll be in that picture. And that's me. All of this was generated from an image. Here's me super fat as a blacksmith. Here's me in the pool. And there's just several of these videos that I've generated. That's going to give you an idea of how good of things you can accomplish here with Hilu too. Now you can see here how to get started. You have three tabs, image to video, text to video and subject reference. So let's go ahead and get started with the image to video. The idea here is to upload an image to use it as a reference. So in this case, I'm going to use uh, this guy here, but you can upload your own image of a subject, a card, a product and turn that product into a video for your product. It can do a whole bunch of things. Okay. So I got the subject here and then I need to let it know what I want to do with this. Okay. Now I have several options. I can add a prompt here. I can go into the camera of movements. 
And I'm going to select this because I really like the feature that it has here on Hilu. So first off, I have the cinematic shots and I can hover over the, for example, this one, the butte, and it's going to show me how it's going to flow, how the camera is going to be controlled. That way I can use it in the video. So I got the right circling and depending on the shot that I want to get, I can use one of these cinematic shots or free selection. So you got here, you can again, hover over this. If you want to do like a straight left, a straight right, a pan, pan right and push in, push out, etc. And you can use these depending on the video that you want to generate with AI. In this case, I'm going to use this one, the circling back. And again, I can write something in this prompt. I can be make it more complex, but I'm going to do it really simple, right? So I'm going to keep it as it is. And then I have the option to enable this to improve the prompt or not. In this case, I wanted to improve since I didn't actually write anything, right? Then I have the option to select the model. Hilo 2, Hilo 1 Director, Hilo 1 Live, and Hilo 1. In this case, I'm going to keep it at Hilo 2. Then I have the option to select the resolution for this. I am going to go with 1080p and 6 second duration or the option for 10 seconds. In this case, let's go ahead and generate this. And that's how easy it is to generate a video here. It's going to start the process and generate the video for me. Now that is for the image video, right? So we're using something as a reference. There's also the option to use text for the video. In this case, I'm going to use this one here. I'm going to keep it simple for now. I'm going to write in the prompt and I am again going to generate it with Hilo 2. I'm going to use 768p, 10 seconds and generate it, right? So again, that's going to kick off and start and generate the video for me. Then I have the subject to reference. So it's going to give me a few terms of use so I don't abuse this. Go ahead and confirm. And then I can start again. I can use a reference as a character and continue from there. So here's my reference and I can make several videos from my face to complete a video. So I can make several clips and make one video. Here we go. I'm going to use this prompt and I'm going to generate it. Here we go. And let's give these a few minutes for those to finish. Let's jump into the other options that Hilo has. And we're going to check out, for example, the image. You can generate images straight from here. And again, you can also use the reference character. You got the model for image one and the type of ratio that you want to use for the image. Great option to generate your images and you can use these images on the reference over here for the image to video, depending if you don't have an image for what you want to use. So it's just super easy and practical to create your AI videos here on Hilu. You got your assets and your gallery. Plus Hilu in the main page has several templates that you can start using right away. So if you hover over any of these, you can use them. I can go ahead and select it. Here we go. And I can go ahead and try it now and just add, for example, my pet. And it's going to generate a similar video to what you're looking right here. So it's a great option to have here. Well, it's a great option to have here. Now you also have the option to chat here. So if you chat with it, you can create a video from the chat. So a lot of available options. Now let's go see our videos that have finished now. And here's the three pieces. So here's the first one with the camera movement, the cinematic camera movement, and it even, it even kept the building. I don't know if it knew what building it was in Turkey, but it practically it did it right. But there you go. Here's one of them. Here's the prompt that I used, just a text to video. So again, similar prompt that I used. You're going to get similar ideas. Little people working there on the watch. Fantastic video. But then the subject to reference. But I check this out. Nice, right? So I can go ahead and recreate this if I need to. I can download it. I can save this and I can post, share, add, feedback, delete, etc. But that's how easy it is to use Hilo. You're going to get fantastic videos from Hilo. So definitely sign up right now and check it out for yourself. See that it's not just me saying it, but it's actually really good. So test it out.